Okay, here's your quick tip. A lot of you are plain air painters. I enjoy painting in plain air. We have a little problem, and that is the design of easels. A lot of easels are designed to tilt at this angle. Uh, more of the, most of the plain air easels, though, are have adjustable angles. Well, here's the point about that. When you are out painting, uh, if your angle, if your easel is tilted at this angle, you're going to get glare. And glare can drive you crazy when you're trying to paint. The other thing is, you set your easel up and you begin painting. The sun is in a single location. And as you're painting, the sun continues to move. And as the sun moves, it can often cause more and more glare to collect on the painting. Um, you'll be painting, in, especially if you're painting in oil, but oil is very wet, you're going to get a lot and lots of glare. Well, I found this little solution. It works for me, and I bet it'll work for you too. Get yourself a little uh, inexpensive flashlight. Take it with you. And when you set your painting up, take with you uh, a, a little painting that you've already got, already got finished, a little painting that you've already finished, um, and, um, and have it varnished so that it has a um, kind of a wet looking surface and then do a test before you start painting set the easel up and tilt it forward something like this now you notice that at this tilt when I shine the light you get glare there's the glare and if I imitate the sun if the sun is moving and I imitate the sun you maybe can get a kind of a sense depending on what the sun's doing and where I am of what kind of glare you're going to have to fight. If you tilt it very slightly this way and you get that tilt set up and you, use, you put your flashlight here you'll see that the glare is gone. So it's a very very simple thing that you can do. Um, the other, other thing I would suggest is when you get, once you get that tilt established tighten your easel up very tight so that it's not going to scoot all over the place. But if you follow that little tip, I think you'll find that the problem of glare will totally disappear in your painting experience. And that's your quick tip.